I'm 29, quit by size of the Pentagon. Just got the shoes as red as for me out. Got magic, I thought she was Hermia. Uh, I'm at Hermione, uh, switch environment. I'm feeling uninspired. What's better for sipping? Then finding my soul and clarity. I'm burying my sins. The blessing is on my evidence. Ayy. I'm a business man without a business plan. Racks and playing the fitness. I've been condemned. New Illuminati ain't the mantra. Uh, I you and Lissa. We gotta walk out slowly. I'm usually dramatic. I'm a raw dog life. I ain't doing no habits. I'm a star from the start. They be calling me Patrick and a like a giant tarantula. a whack thinking they can backstab make them feel the pain like i'm in today i'm living i'm ripping out the page they've been asking where the rap's at i don't need the bread i'ma give it to the fam get a job done like task rabbit on the gas i cannot find a passion on my cash shop third day looking at coins like what am i doing like where do i go man i really gotta get the right you really gotta come to my shows when it is open rock the chanel like my name frank ocean i dress well you want that beat long i'm paying all the bills though money been multiplying like an I really need a crib on the hills though It's probably gonna be good for my mental I pop out, man I was a dropout Whip louder than the rappers I get one on clubhouse I'ma throw their hands whenever I go I'm gonna run out Wanna start but don't know when to do it like I'm Bow Wow Stop the hate, just walk away la They gonna make a home and see the kids I'm awake at night And welcome into the ballpark Happy to have you with us We've got a perfect night for baseball on the show it's the Chicago White Sox taking on the Seattle Mariners. And we'll be back with the first pitch right after this. So just about set, the batter will be the shortstop, Tim Anderson. And a pitch. And a foul ball. Seven o'clock. On the ground. And that's a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Oh, I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. Ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. Out towards right center field. Mateo ranging into the alley. Nice grab on the run. And there's one down. Yasmani Grandal up to hit. Patty third. The catcher. Yasmani Grandal. Foul ball. Anderson runs. And that one fouled off. Anderson, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Swing, and that's ripped towards right center. He's got it. There's two away. Here's Pete Alonso. He's that not going to get cheated up there. The no, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. And first offering is fouled off. Anderson runs. There's a ball. The throw won't get there in time, and they don't get an out on the play. Rudder at second, two down. Next offering is in for a strike. And a swing and a miss. And that is that. Bottom of the first. And now for Seattle, Nico Horner. It's amazing we get a chance to talk 
to a lot of opposing managers. This guy scares managers on the other team as much as anyone. And he gets to fly beneath the radar with the other more recognizable names in this lineup. Gets it to first, and a quick out number one. Here's Chris Bryant now. That in second. The designated hitter. Chris Bryant. That one fouled off. Next offering misses. And one and one. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. On the ground, right side. Toss to Alonzo. And two quick outs in the bottom of the first here tonight. And now here is Ty France. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. The pitch. That one the other way. What a play in right field. And that will end the inning. Back at T-Mobile Park. Top of the second. Now it's the veteran outfielder, Christian Yelich. And the right hander back to work. Ball one there. And the righty deals. And that one upstairs. He doesn't have a play, and he reaches safely. Will Myers now. Kind of a throwback. No batting gloves. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Kicks and fires. Will Myers hammers one. Left field. And it's gone. Home run. Will Myers sends it flying. And that gives him a lead. It's 2-0. Here's Joey Wendell. That is seven. The third baseman, Joey Wendell. Puts it in the air out towards left center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And yeah, there's one away. And now it's the switch hitter, Carlos Santana. The designated hitter, Carlos Santana. Swings through that one. 0 oh and 1. Still only one out here in the inning. Next offering is in for a strike. 0 oh and 2 now. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And there's two away. Two outs, base is empty. Tommy Listella digs in now. And it goes just foul. Back to the mound. And he can't come up with it. No throw, and he's on it first. Now back to the top of the lineup. Here's Tim Anderson. Single to right in his first trip. Now he steps off. Nothing doing. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. Oh, that's that slurve right there. He threw it extremely well. You talk about just a ton of breaks. So tough to get that barrel to. Oh, and two as he waves at that one. Definitely not a pitch location you're expecting up there as a hitter when you know the guy's got a good sinker ball. If he can get in that. A swing and a miss. That retires the side. And that'll do it. Bottom half of inning number two. Now here is Byron Buxton. 
Well, center ball. Well, after putting up a nice Five inning minutes. on offense, got some runs across, Five this minutes. is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. And he'll one. And that one fouled off. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. So digging in, Alejandro Kirk. Alejandro. And the first offering is not close. To third, Wendell gloves it. Zips it to first. Already two out here in the home half of inning number two. Well, off to a great start. He's really cruising out there on the mound. He's got a chance to get through these first two innings with under 20 pitches. That could set him up to go deep into this game. And that one is lifted in the air. And that'll do it. New inning getting started. And now here's a speed threat. Outfielder, Luis Robert. The center fielder. Luis the pitch. Robert. He swings and fouls one off. Here's your one. Just missed. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on. See if you can get a stolen base. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Swing and he breaks his back. Over to first. One up, one down. Good arm side run to that same side hitter right there. Very difficult to put up that ball in the Chicago. air or get through it. Just pours in on the hands. Grandal in the box now as he looks at ball one. Second plate appearance of the day for him. Liner, and that should be extra bases. Now he'll turn it for second. The throw in. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make now them pay. And now it's the polar bear, hmm. Pete Alonso. Alonso. And fouled off. Now the 01. Line drive caught. Here's Yelich at the dish. The left fielder, number 22, Christian Yelich. And it's fouled away. That one ripped. That's back. Pulls it in on the warning track. Welcome back. Turner climbs in on that right side. Leading up for the Mariners, the third baseman. And here it comes. Turner. On the ground to third. Wendell picks it up to first. Leadoff hitter gone in the third. Jorge Mateo now. The right field. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. Can't get their base hit. Around second now as they still don't have it. The throw is wild and it gets away. That's a ball that a lot of times you'll see the shortstop or left fielder be able to get to if it hangs up in the air long That's enough. Done. But right there, the it just hit. died and found a way to drop in on the green stuff for base hit. And you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats. To the plate for one. 
Here's Nico Horner. Good contact guy, good defender. In the air, left side. Yelich drifts towards it, squeezes it, and the inning is over. Back in Seattle, now it's the right fielder, Will Myers. Leading off to the white side. The right fielder, number five, Will Gray. Back Myers. to work. That one misses, and it's 1-0. They say it went. Righty delivers. Hammer, base hit. Around first and hustling for second. In safely. It's a double and his second hit. Here's the third baseman, now Joey Wendell. Third baseman, Joey Wendell. And first offering is fouled off. Next offering is in for a strike. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Brings it in, one away. So now the DH spot, Carlos Santana. Went down on strikes his first time through. Carlos Santana. High fly ball down the left field line. Put the squeeze on it. Runner tags it second. He thought about third, but won't take the chance. It heads back to second. So up next for Chicago, Tommy Listello. 0 for 1 as he reached on an error his first time around. Liner, base hit. Here comes Myers. He'll score, and they lead by three. The tag, and that's out number three, inning over. Trust me when I tell you no exceptions to the rule. Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the inning at the play. Chris Bryant. Leading off for the Mariners. The designated hitter, Chris. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. That one hammered center field. That's back there. Up against the wall and brings it in. Ty France now at the plate. First base. Line drive, base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. Anytime you rip a line drive the other the way, you feel Number really 25. good about what you did Byron. at the plate. You trusted your hands, Buxton. you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. Buxton, the next to hit, takes ball one. And meanwhile, that pitch is off the catcher's mitt. It squirts away. And he'll move up to second, no problem. Should be a pass ball, and that takes away the double play. And now the lefty. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. As a hitter, you got to learn something from that pitch. He clearly wasn't timed up on the fastball. In a 2-0 count, you have to be ready to do damage. Next one misses, and that's ball three. At the belt and fires. That's a slider for a strike. Two strikes to a guy who's already 0 for 1 with the punch out. The only guy in the lineup with that strikeout. But you can't get too relaxed. You still got to make good pitches to get him out. One out and a runner at second. All right, grounder into the outfield for a knock. Flying around third is France. Alonso with a relay throw, and back to first safely he goes. A run scores, it's a two-run game. Runner on at first with one gone, and now the catcher comes up to him. Alejandro Kirk. Foul ball there. Mm -hmm. 
the 0 1. Turned on, but foul wide of third. Ryu moved to first. Buxton back easily. Buxton leads off first with one away. Rudder takes off. Pitch misses in. Throw save. That's a stolen base. And now it's one and two. And that one lifted in the air center field. Robert under it. And puts the squeeze on that one. Runner tags up for third. And he moves up to third. Now two away. The left fielder, number nine, Brandon Nimmo. Nimmo in the box now. No balls and a strike. Oh, he's looking great so far. It helps with over 80% of your first pitches or strikes. He might be able to go the distance if he keeps this up. Lifted in the air, right center field. Myers moving under this one. Makes the catch. That is the inning. All set for the start of the inning. And now it's going to be Tim Maybe Anderson. The, White Sox. the shortstop. Tim Anderson. The pitch. Off the mark there. And that's ball one. Right hander kicks deals. Pitch misses. Two and oh. No strike. And the right hander deals. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. The 2 1. And a foul ball. And he deals. This one popped up. Hampson pulls it down, and there's one away. And now it's Luis Roberts. The, batter, the center fielder, Luis Roberts. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. Now pitch him to Number 53. Christian. Javier. Up the middle. And now up to the plate, Yasmani Grandal. First pitch, and he just misses. Righty to the plate. Swing and a miss. And a swing and a miss there. Clearly, he was sitting on a fastball right there. It just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. Kicks and deals. Robert on the go. Now fly ball to right center. Mateo moving under it. Pulls it down and there's two gone. Pete Alonso steps to the plate for the White Sox. Up next for the White Sox. The first baseman, Pete Alonzo. First offering misses the mark. Well, if he's going to steal second, you want him to go early in the count. That way he's not a distraction to the hitter at the plate. Go ahead and get it. Robert on the go. Swing and a miss. Throw to second. Great jump. So now one and two. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Just kind of have to tip your cap on that pitch. Robert stands at second with two gone.
Two two now. Swing and a miss, and that is that. And welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And stepping in for the Mariners, Justin Turner. The third baseman. Justin Turner. The wind and the pitch. And that one handled. And the leadoff man set down in their half of the fifth. Jorge Mateo the up right next for the Mariners. Jorge Mateo. In there for strike one. These hitters are going to have to find a way to be a little more patient, see more pitches per at bat. Otherwise, that bullpen's not going to have to work over there, and it's going to be advantage pitching all game long. 1-1 one, one now. Swings through that one for strike two. The pitch. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. Here comes a pitch. That one misses. Full count three and two. The wind of the pitch. In the air, left field. Yelich makes the grab. Two down. So two down now. Down and back. here is Garrett Hampson. Garrett. All for one. He hit into a fielder's That's choice good. his first time. That's a laser base hit. Around first. Digging for two. And that's a two-bagger. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. Put a pretty good jolt into that one. Great swing, nice balance and weight transfer. And he got it to drop in out there in the deep part of the field. And yeah, first offering is fouled off. Two outs and one in scoring position. That misses, and the count is one and one. High fly ball out to center field. Makes the grab on the run. And that is that. Back at T-Mobile Park. Now the left. Fielder Christian Yelich. The left fielder, number 22, Christian Yelich. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the man. The pitch. Number 56. Swing and a miss. Taylor. Strike one. Field ball. Left hand batter waits. No need to offer that pitch until you get to two strikes. It's just a low percentage of success when you want to try to go after that down and away pitch. Next offering down in the dirt. And a pitch. That one blasted deep to right. This one's got a chance. And out of here. Christian Yelich leaves the yard. And they boost their lead. It's 3-1.
Will Myers getting ready to hit. And a foul ball. And in foul ground, he pulls it down. What out? Down the third baseman, Joey Wendell. Now batting. Third baseman, Joey. White Sox making a move for pinch hitter, Charlie Culberson. Number 10, Charlie Culberson. Line drive to short and caught. Two outs, base is empty. Now Carlos that, Santana hit. will hit next. Carlos Santana. First pitch doesn't find the zone. The next offering misses. Ball two. And a pitch. Out to short. On the run, sends it over to first. And that is that. Yes. Welcome back. Bottom of the sixth inning. And now, Chris Bryant. Leading off for the Mariners, the designated hitter. Chris. The wind of the pitch. Bryant. And that one in the air center field. Robert makes the grab. One pitch and one out. Ty France up next for the Number Mariners. Really good piece of hitting last time. Oh. Going to the opposite field. That one's in there, 0 and 1. When a guy's throwing a lot of first pitch strikes as a hitter, you've got to be ready to hit. Now, that's not going to help you get deep into his pitch count and into the bullpen, but you've got to take what he's offering that day. Two down. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there, that front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left on the ground and that one finds its way through so he gets on base and keeps it going well that started and ended pretty quickly no messing around right there now Couldn't get any air under it but he smoked that ball back up the middle timing was just perfect got great wood on it and there's just no chance for the infielders with how hard here's a rip to short but he's there for the third out Back in Seattle, we go to the top of the seventh. Tommy Listella to the plate. The the second base Welcome Ladies back as we have a pinch hitter to lead, to lead it off. Glaber Torres. To the White Sox. Number 25. The pitch. Glaber Torres. Hard ground ball base nine. Here's the shortstop at the Chicago. play. Tim Anderson. Tim Anderson. Line to left, and that's a fair ball. The throw to third. Throw comes in. Runner stopped. Second and third. Nobody out. So up next, Luis now Robert the for the fourth field. time tonight. Luis Robert. This one in the air right field. Base hit. One run is in. Well done. Drives in the run. When you pop a ball up like that, you now don't that. expect it to get you <laughs> not too often. But right there, somehow he got it to drop in behind first base, and that's where no one could get to it. Number 71. Tyler Roger. And the batter now, Yasmani Grandal. Fought off foul. Anderson, the runner at third. Robert at first with no outs. Robert on the go. Pitch is low. No throw, he's in there safely. Hit weakly on the ground. Throws to first. 
finally gets the first out here on the grounder. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was looking for. Ball on the ground. The nice ground out. The first baseman, Pete Alonzo. And first offering is fouled off. One down, runners at second and third. On the ground to the left. Corner over to first. Out number two and another run comes in. Now it's Christian Yelich. He's already homered in this game. Now back, left field, Christian Yelich. Swings through that one. 0 and 1. He's been great in this one. Eye hand coordination just failed him a little bit right there. Comes up empty on the swing. 0 and 2 now. Quickly in an 0-2 count, you've got to figure out a way to shorten your path to the baseball. Put it in play somewhere, then you got a chance. That misses the zone. Ball one. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. It's time for the traditional seventh inning stretch. Back here at the ballpark, here's Brandon Nimmo. Leading up for the Mariners, the left fielder, Brandon the pitch. Nimmo. And there's the strike. These guys have been very aggressive early in the count, but when you're down, you might want to be a little more patient, take some pitches, see if you can extend those at bats and get some base runners off. That's a base hit, so a man on base to start the inning. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. Just an awesome swing of the bat, quick hands, and just launched the baseball. 108 on the exit velocity. Man, that is coming off the bat pretty good. I know he's feeling good about it. So now Turner in on that right side. And the pitch. And a foul ball. At the belt and fires. Nope. Off the mark there. And it's one and two. I don't like to say he wasted a pitch. I think that was a purpose pitch. Change the eye level. Have him look up. Now go back exactly where you want to go. And here it comes. In the air. Left field. And Turner is retired. And there's one down. And at first, digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, like Jorge here. Mateo. One for two. Jorge. Mateo. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. This is one of those situations defensively where you can't try to do too much. you got to make sure that you feel the ball cleanly and get one out first. It's going to be tough to get two with this kind of speed in the batter's box. The 1-1. One, one. That one fouled off. Nimmo stands at first with one out. Next offering is fouled back. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. So he's gotten deep into this game. And at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. And first offering is fouled off. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Well, this looks like it's going to be a wasted opportunity. It's frustrating when you get the leadoff man on, but you can't get him into scoring position. They're going to need a big knock. Try to put something up on the board. This is inside. Rudder takes off, stays alive. In the air, out towards right center. Robert on the move, makes a nice running catch. And that is the third out of the inning.
and welcome back. And now the right fielder, Will Myers. Leading off to the right side. The right fielder on the five. And Will he Myers. deals. Myers. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. Right-handed reliever. Inside just missed. And there's a hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff dot. This is Charlie Culberson to hit. The third baseman, Charlie Culberson. This to center field. Buxton settles underneath it. Makes the grab. And there's one down. So digging in, Carlos Santana. Now batting the designated hitter. Carlos Santana. And that one wrapped foul. Out towards right center field. Buxton settles under this one. Snags it for the second out. Here is the young phenom, Glaber Torres. The second baseman, Glaber Torres. Fouled off. He was late. Up the middle, and it finds its way through for a hit. Oh, the throw is wild. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. Just kept it simple. Played so Pepper with the middle set. of the infield and sure. took it back where it came yeah. from, and there's just no one there to knock it down. Now here is Tim Anderson, and that's in there for strike one. one down this to third Turner collects it throw is high and over his head the tag and that's out number three inning over out to the bottom of the eighth here's the Seattle leadoff man Nico Horn not shortstop. So they bring on the veteran, Keith Henry. And he'll try to keep this big lead right where it is. Number 53, Keith Henry. And the pitch. There's a strike. Now wanted to walk. And a pitch. Liner snagged it first. And up next for Seattle, Chris now Bryant. The designated hitter, Chris Bryant. In there, and it's 0 1. They always say it's the best pitch in baseball. Strike one. You get ahead on a good hitter as well. He's a little bit more confidence to move to the at bat. 0 oh, 2 as he waves oh, at that one. It might be time to choke up a little bit, get that front foot down early, maybe even just spread out. He's really late right now. The punch out there, two down. Two outs, base is empty. Ty the France point. up next the for the Mariners. Point. Popped up. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. And that ends the inning. Back at T-Mobile Park, we go to the ninth, and now Luis Robert. Right the center fielder, Luis. The right-hander back to work. And first offering is fouled off. And the right-hander deals. That one inside, one ball, one strike. Righty to the plate. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Yeah. 
Bounce to the right. Hampson collects it. And they take care of Robert for the out. Deceptive slider right there. Stayed in the tunnel a long time. Got that hitter out front. Rolled over it. Put it on the ground. Yasmani Grandal. The next to hit. And that one fouled off. And the righty deals. And there's a foul ball. Well struck right field. And that one is gone. He rockets one to right. And they add to the lead. It's 6-1. Pete Alonso steps to the plate for the White Sox. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Comes up empty on the swing, 0-2 oh, now. Well, you got the hitter already chasing that nasty slider. If you're on the mound, you just want to expand the zone right now. Get a swing and miss and get through this at bat. One down, base is empty. And yeah, that's outside. One and two. Righty delivers. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Pete Alonso takes it deep. And they add on. It's 8 1. So up next, Christian Yelich. He's already homered here in this one. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention, please. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Number 63. Left hand hitter waits. Strike two. Definitely not going to make his highlight tape. Swing at a ball lifted to center field. That drops in, plays it on a hop. Throws to second. This offense is on fire. Three extra base hits in a row. These days, most outfielders play pretty deep, and I'm not sure if that was a factor there or not, but off the bat, you're thinking it's going to be a pop-out, and it just kind of nestled into that spot where no one was able to get to it. Nimmo makes the play. Two away down. Here's the third baseman, Charlie Culberson. Nevada, the third baseman, Charlie Culberson in there for strike one. Is there a little wrinkle to that? I think there was. Yeah. Little slider action. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. More and more guys are looking to slug regardless of the count. In this situation, we'll keep a close eye on his approach. The 0-2. And he chases that one. Good job at damage control right there. Back in Seattle, here's Byron Buxton. Way to go for the Mariners. The center fielder. Hembry back to work. Buxton. And that one fouled off. The pitch swings through the fastball up in the zone. Well, that's today's style of baseball right there, right? Big time velo on the bump and big time pop at the plate. Next pitch downstairs, and the count is one and two. Down on strikes. And the leadoff man retired here in the ninth. And here's the catcher, Alejandro Kirk. Alejandro. In the air to left center. Yelich should have this one. And puts the squeeze on that. And there's two away. Two outs, space is empty. Brandon the Nimmo fielder, up next nine. for the Mariners. Brandon. Yelich ranges to his right, and he's got it. Ball game. 
And the White Sox take this one in a blowout. Well, these guys just hadn't been playing fundamentally sound baseball, but today they put it together. This should start them rolling now. You have to pay attention to the details. If you do that with good pitching, good defense, you will win most of your ball games.